Uh, Greens, um, celebrating today 125th commemorative season for Bristol. Um, fantastic to see everyone here. Tell me a little bit about this area. It's the, it's the fan zone, isn't it? Yeah, this is aimed at the uh, the young kids, really. Uh, I think sort of 7 to 16-year-olds. Plenty to do. There's a bungee run. A picture uh, in the front row here behind us throwing a ball competition through Robbo's mouth. You know, the community part of the club is, is a massive part, you know, and the outreach to tens of thousands of kids every year at the clubs, at the schools, uh, you know, uh, less fortunate kids. And it's part of giving back, really, to add to the matchday experience for them. And to be able to celebrate this commemorative season on a day like today with so many fans, it must be fantastic for the players, the staff and the supporters as well. Yeah, I mean, the weather's obviously going to make it a carnival atmosphere. Um, you know, it's a great day for the club. Uh, the, the fans particularly who have uh, been watching the game since they were little kids, you know, it's a great club and this is just celebrating that really. It's the last year at the Mem, so this 125th year makes it extra special. And the fact that a game has actually fallen on the day of the first game 125 years ago makes it a, you know, a special day and I'm sure the fans will enjoy it. And the way that Bristol want to play this year and the way that I know Bedford will play will make it a good game, I'm sure. And we've seen obviously a lot of the events here aimed at the kids, but great to see some of the adults and older fans participating as well. Yeah, it's we want to engage with all the fans, you know, from young to old. It's, it's part and parcel of Bristol's uh, culture and obviously we're thinking of the future as well and moving to Ashton Gate and pushing Bristol uh, on off on the pitch as well as well as off the pitch and the young kids and the families are the target market for a rugby club and it's great to see so many here and of course 125 years is a long time and um, as you said Bristol have moved a long way from when they first started and are looking for bigger and better things yeah I mean a lot's happened in 10 years let alone 125 I mean 10 years ago Bristol were at the top of the game in the Premiership Heineken Cup rugby and now we're in the championship you know it all comes from 125 years ago where it all started uh, Leicester, Gloucester, Bristol, they're, they're, Bristol are up there with the oldest clubs with the greatest heritage and whilst you can't rely on history to make, um, you have to deserve, deserve to get where you uh, will be in the future. We're, we're working hard to get back into the Premiership but you know with a history like this that's where the club deserves to be and we'll, we'll do our utmost to uh, make sure of that.